Hey guys, today this video is all about camouflage. We're going to be talking mostly about the Cryptek camouflage line, although we will mention Multicam as well as Marpat. Um, let's talk about Cryptek first because that's primarily what this video is about and that's become pretty much my go-to camouflage, uh, even though Multicam is still my favorite. But uh, Cryptek, in case you guys haven't heard, is been taking the industry uh, by storm lately. Um, it was founded by two combat veterans who served together in Afghanistan. And Cryptek's kind of catchphrase is from the backcountry to the battlefield. And it's a really, really innovative uh, camo pattern, I think, that is very effective. Um, and I think it's really, really cool, the, the, the name Cryptek camo, because Cryptek was derived from the word Kryptos. And uh, it's a Greek word for hidden or secret. And this is off the Cryptic Outdoor Group uh, Facebook page. Uh, and then they say the Greek word techno, or techni, meaning art, craft, or skill. Therefore, the meaning of cryptic, uh, as intended by the founders, is the art of being hidden, which I think is really, really cool. Um, cryptic is a very, very unique pattern uh, that kind of has a pattern for every type of environment you might you might find. And what we have here is your Mandrake, your Typhon, your Nomad, and then your uh, Highlander. Uh, also uh, is Yeti, which is a snow pattern, and then Raid, which is kind of an uh, off-color uh, ACU. Uh, looks like it's more effective than uh, the Army combat uniform, uh, primarily used for urban environments, as the name, uh, as the name suggests. Uh, Raid and Yeti are not yet released. Uh, I don't know when they're going to be out. I, I would imagine Yeti will be coming out soon, and I haven't heard anything about Raid. Um, anyway, it's a great, great product line. Uh, the Mandrake is obviously uh, intended for triple canopy or jungle use, uh, in, bonded around in the woods. It's a great, great camouflage, one of my favorites in the line. Um, Typhon is primarily used, obviously, for people, uh, night ops. When I think Typhon, I think guys who are uh, SWAT operators. I think this would be a great camouflage uh, for SWAT operators. Um, your Nomad, obviously, is going to be for your arid or desert climates. I think this would have been a great camo pattern uh, for Iraq. Uh, even though when I was in Iraq, I, I was wearing Marpat, and I, I love Marpat. I think it's a great camouflage, but this also would have been great. And then... On the uh, far right here, we have the Highlander, which, uh, as the name suggests, is perfect for uh, the Highlands. And also, I think it is just a great all-around uh, uh, camouflage for uh, the Midwest and the Western United States, especially during the fall. I think this would be a great camo pattern. Okay. And like I've already said, Cryptek, uh, they, they don't try and encompass uh, every type of environment um, with one pattern. They have several types. They have six different patterns. Four, which are actually out right now, which you see in front of you. And uh, they're really, really great. Vertex is the manufacturer. And it's rate made of a very, very, uh, very strong, rugged material. Um, you have, uh, it is a, is a button-up uh, top with zippers, um, very uh, big uh, belt loops. And uh, it is made of a 50% um, nylon cotton and uh it's just a really really great material again now i've been using uh cryptek a lot lately and uh you can see me rocking it in a couple of my videos um it's really my go-to camo um, i'm not too uh i haven't really ran their their tops but I'm, I'm a big fan of their of their combat pants they're very very strong material very very comfortable um, you have your back pockets just like you would imagine you've got your uh pockets traditional pockets and then you also have cargo pockets um, uh, as you can see right here uh, so pretty much just like any other uh, camouflage pattern or the pot the pocket placement would be um, and, and I mean I really am a big fan of Cryptek it's really growing on me um, multicam is still my favorite uh, I, I'm really looking forward to uh, Cryptek patterns coming out with uh, combat shirts like this multicam one right here. I wish they would make those in the uh, Cryptek pattern. Playtac, an Australian company, is the only company right now that I know of that offers that. Uh, but uh, they're Australian, so hopefully uh, someone in the U.S. will pick up on that quick hint, hint. 
Um, multicam is still my favorite. I've been running multicam for uh, about four years now. And I really, really like that pattern. It's still my favorite. And I think it is just the best all around camouflage uh, pattern out there. Um, and, and I certainly, certainly enjoy Marpat. I think Marpat's been around, I think since 2003 at least. And, uh, and I think it's just a great pattern. What's interesting to note is all these camouflages and plus a bunch of other camouflages were just put in a, uh, in a uh, contest and actually out of all these uh, camo patterns plus several others uh, Marpat was actually found to be the most effective pattern um, across the board which I which I find very interesting because the Marine Corps has been using that for uh, for several years now so um, anyway that's just kind of look at uh, a, a different look guys at uh, different camo patterns um, but primarily I want to talk about the cryptic line of, uh, of clothing um, it's a great alternative to multicam, and again, you know, this would be perfect for tactical applications as well as hunting, as well as hunting, you know. So depending on what part of the United States you're in, you know, it'd be a great, uh, a great uh, pattern for you to pick up for for hunting. It doesn't have to necessarily be uh, uh, tactical applications, but I, I just enjoy running these. You know, they're they're a great lightweight, strong, durable uh, material. And I just think they look cool. I really dig the uh, snakeskin looking uh, pattern. So again, you got your Highlander, your Nomad, your Typhon, and your uh, Mandrake. And uh, I really dig them. Um, again, I still am a big fan of Multicam. I, I do think that is the best pattern out there. Um, but at the end of the day, you know, you know, I know a lot of people are like, well, it's just another fad. I think I think Cryptek's going to be around for a while, guys. So. Um, Get, you know give it a chance um, they are fairly pricey I think the pants usually run about a hundred dollars um, 110 maybe the tops are about 110 120 somewhere in there um, the vertex website for a while was actually having everything 40% off so that's when I snagged everything up but uh, they are pricey but you you do get what you pay for guys so um, look forward to seeing me running this uh, camo pattern in uh, future videos and if you have any questions uh, leave a comment below thanks for watching